Duradel it is. Let's go get our first task. All right, Duradel. I don't believe, yeah, no, we do not have a task. So I, I, I don't know about that one. I don't feel like doing sire. It's really not like super great money. So let's go ahead and do lizard man. No, no, no. no I don't think I want to do those either, to be honest with you. Uh, God damn it. Oh, we could do this. We could do this. It would be. All right, we'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. Um, we'll do 35 Abyssal Sire. That's a little bit better than 200. And it's at least potential to do back-to-back -back boss tasks. So what I'll do is I'll bring my Slayer Cape for the next one. And hopefully we can get another boss task. Yes, we got an Unsired. I honestly really didn't think we were going to get one this task because we never do. And our drop rate for Unsireds is a little shit. So let's go ahead and take a look at the log. This is Unsired number six. We have yet to see a single piece of the bludgeon and we have yet to see a pet. Let's see what we get. Something nice. Ah, uh, God damn it. Another Abyssal Dagger. Alrighty, final kill coming in. Beautiful. We got an extra 5k Slayer XP for completing the boss task. And that is 473 tasks in a row. We did actually see you unique, technically, so I'm not going to complain. We did make a couple mil off the task. We're going to finish off the wild card roll at 477 total tasks. So I'm going to go ahead and grab our gloves, our slayer cape as well. We'll throw that bad boy on. And hopefully we can get another boss task from Duradel. Task number two, smoke devils. Smoke devils, smoke devils. Uh, you know what? Yeah, fuck it. All right, that's a, that's a drop. An occult necklace and a hard clue. Same drop. Another occult necklace coming in. Hey, an elite clue. We do have quite a bit on the log for the elite clues themselves rather than masters. So we're going to start doing them, and they do give a pretty decent chance at getting a master anyway, so we might as well give them a go. Already elite casket for 100k. That's actually not bad for the elite. There is the smoke devil task done. Sadly, no pets to see. But we did make a pretty decent amount of money this task. And uh, believe it or not, in the last 700 kills, we got just the occult necklaces we got on this task, which is kind of depressing. Already task number three is not going to be dust devils. No, thank you, sir. Cow fight. We could do some cow fight queen. We do have the new Karis. I think I think I'm actually going to give this one a go. There's a big hit. 147. That's why we are using the new partisan. My God, that is insane. Hey, the combat task, the cow fight queen veteran. I totally forgot that would come in at 50 KC. <laughs> I accidentally. Oh, shit. Dope. All right. Well, uh, I accidentally just got a elite combat task done with a, v I think it was kill it with a venge. I'm assuming that's what just happened, but we got a KQ head on the same drop. Would you look at that? Alrighty. So I did roughly 20 something KC. I think we're going to call it at uh, KQ for the rest of that task. I think I'm just going to go and finish him off with a cannon. Had a guy try to crash me with like 13 defense i'm assuming that's what it was but uh obviously it didn't go too well for him uh but regardless it just got me kind of bored so um partisan of breaching was super dope definitely something that's going to be really nice when i decide to come back to cow fight queen in the future as far as right now is concerned it's really not that great money and uh we got a kq head very very quick to come and do this down here much better in my opinion let's go ahead and go grab another task we only got two tasks left hopefully we can get something that makes a little bit of money Kerr asks uh, uh, they do make okay ish money but not really enough for me to care definitely not fire giants that's for sure cerberus yes that is what i'm talking about we're doing 35 of those let's go get some money and the last kill of the task done with, sadly, no beautiful crystals to see on the ground. Vampires, I will do that. And finally, that task is done. So let's go ahead and get another wheel task. Give it a spin. Hey, collection log slot. Ancient plate body. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and spin the wheel. Hopefully we get something 
different, I will say. I, I don't know, maybe some boss KC? Nice. All right, let's see what we're going to kill. Big old boss list. Let's see what we roll. Man, I think I've only ever spun this once, or maybe twice now. What? Oh? Uh -huh. Oh, shit. Looks like we're doing 50 gauntlets KCs. Yes, finally, we managed to grab the double blood shard while thieving virus. Uh, we have uh, been avoiding doing gauntlet. Uh, I know, I know I should probably be doing it. Almost exactly on rate as well. 4,100 pickpockets it took us to finally see the very first blood shards and almost just in time to get ourselves our next level as well. 7.2K away. And there it is, 94 thieving coming in with the 826,000 XP until 95. But that's another big skill at the moment. It's pretty much just that and agility right now, contesting for highest skill until 99. I go, oh, no, I guess can't sleep on woodcutting. Woodcutting is actually technically higher. Got ourselves a beautiful master clue from an easy that we did from a shooting star that I found. Hopefully we can clutch something beautiful from it. Nope, but 150 master KC coming in. That is a pretty nice milestone to hit. Uh, if only we could see a few more uniques. Little while later, we finally hit 95 thieving. That is going to be 912k away from 96. And it is now officially the second highest second highest behind agility and last night in uh bed i actually did hit over 10 million total agility agility xp so that is a pretty big milestone pretty happy to see Alrighty, first kc of 50 of the gauntlet that is number 22 so that means once we are done with this 50 we will be at a beautiful 71 kc anything nice to start it out absolutely not really. <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, that's only like 50k. Hey, we got 3, 2, 1 range combat task completed, which is an elite. Beautiful. And third loot is not too shabby. New personal best, 8 minutes and 31 seconds. Still pretty shit, but it is better than the last. And there's a collection log slot, Piscarilius Scarf. It's a shame it is worth absolutely nothing. Another big level coming in, 95 woodcutting. This is definitely now... My favorite AFK skill because it requires like maybe one click every six minutes, uh, depending on how lucky you are with the redwood spawns. But beautiful, that is two two three three total level. We're so close to four hundred mil total XP as well, and we're just yeah knocking the levels out. Honestly, uh, the Christmas event finally came out today so we got to go and do that so it's time to take a break from this and then once we're done with the christmas event i think it's time to finally go and knock out the rest of our gauntlet kc for our 50 kc spin hey and the red cavalier coming in on the hard clue for a collection log slot hey an elite clue finally elite clue loot oh no collection log slots but we are one away from 90 Let's go. Another easy completed with a collection log slot. Black plate skirt T. Shame it's not really worth anything. And another bullshit medium. Can you believe it? We literally did another woodcutting level AFK at work. And while we lay in bed, we are just gaming on these woodcutting levels. But we are now approaching the long run. So over 1 million XP until the next level. And that's how it's going to be for the next three. So... Probably going to be a few days, if not a week or so, or even longer in between each one, unfortunately. Got a few clue scrolls here. We got an elite from the gauntlet, and then one of every other tier as well. So hopefully we can see a master in here. There's a beginner. An easy with nothing, medium with nothing, a hard with uh, nothing but some decent money, and an elite with a mimic. Oh, yes. Alrighty, and the Mimic is done with the new personal best as well. 14 seconds. We got a crazy claw spec. Anything beautiful. Damn it. Another elite clue from Gauntlet. We are just raking him in today for the 177k. Got a nice scale of every little clue here, except for an easy, surprisingly, from wood cutting today while it works. So hopefully we can claim at least one unique or at least one master from this. Obviously nothing from the beginner, of course, nothing from the medium. Hard is also, eh, fine, you know, 100k, I'll take that. And 55k from the elite. Another day and another woodcutting level 97 coming in. Two left 
until this skill is done and I can no longer have a beautiful thing to AFK while at work. I would say by the end of the week, we could potentially be looking at getting ourselves another 99 and following that will be a very quick 99 fire making as well because once that's done uh, we'll have to knock out both of them honestly i may even stop uh, a few hundred kxp from 99 wood cutting so i can just finish it off at winter tot and then that way we can just kind of knock out two birds with one stone a little bit of zero time uh, xp if you know what i'm saying hey combat task perfect crystalline hunliff on 69 nice kc anything good for the loot uh, not really and there it is, KC71, which puts us at a beautiful 50 for the wheel spin total. Anything nice, a dragon halberd. I will take it. And two rune play plagues, honestly. One of the better rewards for the regular gauntlet, so uh, not too shabby. I think I might send one single uh, corrupted gauntlet. I did a few throughout this. I just didn't count it towards a 50 gauntlet, KC. But I uh, think I got it down. We don't have a high total, Casey, but I definitely think I got it down just with the amount of practice I've gotten just from doing the regular gauntlet. When I send one of those, we'll spin the wheel like butter, except very slow. But we did it. Casey, number four for um, pretty shit loot. Damn it. I thought I was expecting something good. Let's spin that wheel. Finally, another wheel spin. Seems like it's been forever since we've actually given this a go. But what are we saying is going to be the next thing to do? It is a skilling level. Let's see what we're going to be working on. All right, skilling wheel spin. Let's give it a go. Not really sure what I want here, but uh, we'll take what we can get. Okay, there it is. Agility level. Ho, ho, ho. Let's go. A ham joint from an easy clue. That is a collection lock slot as well as a nice 2.7 mil in the pocket with the ancient robe legs as well. Uh, at a nice 95k, we got a hard clue and an elite clue with another one black dehyde chaps T for another 118k. Quick pause on the agility grind to come and snag this beautiful AFK skill level. 98 wood cutting, one level to go. A very hefty 1.2 million XP until 99. But what we'll be doing is we'll probably get down to, I'm going to say probably about five, maybe 600 KXP left until 99. And then we will be heading straight to Winter Tot and finish off 99 fire making and wood cutting at the same time. I'm not sure exactly how much XP we'll be getting from Winter Tot um, from 93 to 99. I, I'm going to ballpark like 250, 300 K XP, but I don't know for sure. So that's why we're going to be safe. And push it at that like five or six hundred kxp and then that way if we have anything left over obviously we can end up finishing it off but as of right now we are only 200 kxp away from 97 agility so we'll have to go and finish that off should just be a couple more hours and by a couple i mean double that so four more hours of agility but uh we'll get it done and then um yeah uh, this will honestly, 99 woodcutting, or at least the remaining XP that we're going to do before Winter Tot is probably going to be finished in the next couple days. I've been able to do roughly like five or 600k woodcutting XP while at work, thankfully. So uh, since it's such a great skill to do while I'm getting paid to do it, I've been doing it quite a bit. So we'll probably be finishing that off. And honestly, we may even interrupt the wheel spin to finish off 99 fire making at winter tot as well so that that way we can just get it done get two more capes added add a bunch more total levels to our uh maxing grind and uh we'll be we'll be gaming oh frog slippers from a beginner is that uh let me take a look where are we at oh two left sandwich lady hat and the monk's robe top tee till we're done with the log nothing there and uh penguin mask oh Look at us. Hey, Black Wizard Hat G for another collection log slot and 330 beautiful coins. And finally, the task has been completed. 97 agility. Holy shit, I don't even want to look. But two more levels until we have another like huge 99 this and rune crafting are like my pride and joy <laughs> so hopefully we'll we'll end up knocking this out over the course of the next little while it's gonna take a, a long while but we will be doing it in the background whenever laying in bed and stuff um it'll be kind of like the thing that i can do when i pay attention but slightly afk while i watch shows and whatnot uh as for the wheel spin i am actually going to take a pause on that right now because actually uh with this lucky amount of AFK time I've had recently, we did manage to finish off 
the woodcutting grind, which means we are ready to go to winter tot and finish off higher making and woodcutting at the exact same time. So I'm going to wait before I spin the wheel again. We're going to put all of our focus into the woodcutting and fire making grind because I honestly just want to get those two skills knocked out of the way. We're very close. Winter Todd is like 300k plus XP per hour. So it's going to be very, very quick from 93 to 99 and we're very close to 94. So it's basically 94 to 99. Be very quick and then uh, we'll get the woodcutting XP from Winter Todd on our way there and then we'll probably have to finish a little bit off at the redwoods i didn't want to go any farther just in case because i don't actually know how much xp we're going to get in woodcutting but we're gonna we're gonna give it a go and that'll be honestly that's going to be the next focus so uh, i will be slowly taking away at the laps like i said uh until 98 but 1400 at 70 ish laps an hour that's pretty rough that's like 20 hours just for this next level so um it's going to be a minute, but we will definitely knock some of it out. I've got a nice, decent winter break. It is just about Christmas time at the time of this recording. And uh, yeah, so I'm ready to game. Ready to game.